Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Aussie Farming in Philippines. Well, over here, buddy. Come and put some over here on this one. Well, Bob taught me this morning on the um, chickens. So we've got some rice rice. Yeah, see it on the ground here? Yeah. <laughs> muck, 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 muck. They'll all come running out everywhere. All right, we'll come over here and do something. They love, they love rice. They just go ape shit on rice. <laughs> muck, 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 muck. Well, guys, what a great day yesterday. To everyone who um, give us birthday wishes on a birthday wishes, I want to say thank you very much. Thank you very much. So many on Facebook, so many everywhere. I want to say thank you, thank you, thank you. We had a really, really good day yesterday. I got to do some cooking back up again, making up spring rolls. So I made spring rolls for a while. So that was quite good. Buck, 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 buck. Buck, 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 buck. Okay, I'll throw some down here. And I'll all come running. Buck, 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 buck. Buck, buck. Here they come, look. Here they come. Okay. First on, on this on this concrete area here, Bob. That's it. Buck, 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 buck. Come on, guys. Well, it was quite good. Um, so, so Scott gave me a beautiful birthday present. It was um, a GoPro light that fits onto your camera and a GoPro speaker as well. So now I can film in dark. So if it's um, giving the chickens or the goats or anything inside where normally I can't film, or I do film, but it's just black, now I've got the light and I've got the speaker, so it should be nice and clear. So we're right turning around the backwards or frontwards into the speaker, we can now speak. So that's good. And Bob, Bob got me the most beautifulest fucking steak. The most beautifulest steak. He goes, here you go, son. Happy birthday, mate. And I looked and went, oh, <laughs> wank, wank, wank. So fucking yummy. Lovely. And of course, Chick gave me the same presents he gives me every year, only different. A belt. Every year I get a belt from Chris, from my um, chick. Every year, a belt. So, there you go. But it was a good night, so um, Scott and his wife have left. They're headed back home to get have breakfast at their place, over there. So what we're going to do is we're going to change all this over now. Change all this over. Oh, he's done, he's done the handpiece. He's done the handpiece, but not the... Right. Right, so incubator babies last night. Hey little guys. So I've got them in there, I've got to work out a home for them with a heat lamp. So the other, the other chickens are in the heat lamp. <gasps> no tired guys. I don't know what time we went to bed, I don't remember going to bed last night, I'll tell you. Lucky it was, was, lucky it was the right bed, that's the one thing, lucky it was the right bed. Alright, let's see how we go for the day guys. Come on I, you can do it. Right guys, so this is the birthday cake from yesterday. So um, we were too much in the party mood last night that we forgot all about it. We had all the blowouts beforehand, of course, but um, the actual slicing and tasting, we didn't hit. So we gotta go and eat some calories. Oh, aye. Mm. You gonna try? Come on. Come on, you can do it. I was on the diet, she says, no, I don't want to. Go on, I take it, take it, go on, you take. Which one do you want? Take, take the whole lot. Take the, on. One. take the big one. Take the big one. Yummy. Where's mine? Don't pass out. Is that my one? Oh. Yummy. This one, Ginger? Yep. Yeah. Take, take one. Go on, take it. Go on. Go on, off you go. That's hers. That's hers. Take the big one. Tell her which one to take. Oh. Do you hear it clearly? Yeah. Oh, good. So we're just checking the, um, the camera with Chick Chick Bob over here. While well, we're up with the goats. I'll tell you, very good little cameras then, I'll tell you. Very, very good. Hello, William. So I'm just waiting for tonight. We couldn't test it last night with the um, rain. But uh, hopefully tonight, there's a bit of fun. Oh, look, a rainbow over there. Hopefully tonight, then we can see what it like goes from infrared into light mode and things like that, see how it goes. But I'm happy with that. Bloody good lights, mate, I tell you. Bloody good. Bloody good cameras. Right, so the goats are going well. So the, the larger goats are all pregnant. Okay, the one on the left, Melly. There's Jane in the 
in the middle, the little one's near a leg. So mama give me some tit and black bitch. So um, they're pregnant, so that's good. So we'll keep Antonio so he can mate with them again and then he can mate with those three little girls. They'll be big enough to mate with them and then we'll rehome him. So we rehomed the, the stud guy, not the girl. Some people rehome the mothers, but uh, we don't. So what we do now is, like I said, he, he can breed with all them girls. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. He can breed with six of them next season. So that's good. More coin. More coin for the farm. Got to be happy with that. Next time she said, why not get a case of beer? Got to be fucking happy with that. You know what I mean? Happy, happy, happy. Right, well, everything's going well. We've cleaned up down the side, so we'll go down there and have a look, see? See what it looks like. Hey! Hey! You're a fucking rooster! You don't to fuck Snow White! You're going in the pot, fella. You watch out. You watch out, fella. Hey! That'll be a weird fuck. What do you call that? A chicken duck? Hey! That rooster trying to root Snow White! Fuck me. It's alright guys, Daddy's just walking through. Just walking through, don't see here, move on. Right, so boy messaged yesterday and said, can you come and work? He said, gee guys, even if we got rain, is there anything you can do around the house or whatever? I said, yeah, we'll find something for him. There's always something to do on the Aussie farm, you know? Otherwise it turns into a behovel, doesn't it? You don't want that shit to fucking happen. Right, so I said, right, what I've wanted to do the last few days is clear up this creek. So Martin and I put wire along here, netting, to stop the ducks going out. There's still two out there, I have to get them in the morning. There's still two out there. But um, that's no problem. So we've got them to clear all the way along the sides here. Would have liked it a bit more, but not to worry. So I want to be able to walk along the side. Fuck me, you must be a skinny bastard. Oh, fuck my dog. Oh, I tell you. I tell you. Should have been like this. All the way through. But he's put all new posts in. See here? All along here. Put all new posts all the way along. So he can get cut posts down up the back, five foot long, and ram them down. Get the cable ties and put the cable ties onto it. Which he's done. Oh, fuck, because the radio. Shit, lucky they can go in the water. Fuck my dog. See, shit like this got to be trimmed up. Oh, it's not too bad. Listen, it's, it's a bit better than what it was, so I can't complain too much. But oh, he's done a great job with these poles, guys. Now our land is actually there on that bank. That's actually our land is there. So it runs down as you see where the wire is here to that tree. Then it runs along this bank and goes across the creek up over there, and then it goes along our side of the, again. So the worst thing is we couldn't um, we, we couldn't dig any of that out and put the creek over there, could we? Because it's a fucking hill. But I tell you, if it wasn't a hill, definitely I would have done that. I would have dug that out over there, given given them the creek. 100% would have done that. But uh, geez, he's done a good job. He works bloody hard, that boy. He works very hard. I think because today being being All Saints Day, it's like uh, no work. So I'll go and go and work with Chick. Chicken will. That's okay. Look at all these idiots cut down the tree and they fell through the fence and fucking wrecked it. Fucking dickheads. Seriously. All along here, look. Whole, tr whole fucking tree fell down. Totally wrecked this up like anything. Oh, he's cable tied it. That's different. We'll use nothing, but still. That's okay. Right, let's go along here. It is all nice and new. I like it. So that's our fence line there, as you can see. I put the wire through to distinguish where it is because the people over here said, oh no, your fence line's over here. We said, yeah, that's to keep the animals in and the dogs out. So the actual fence line, the marker's over in that corner. That's where the marker is. So Bob and I run this wire through some time back just to say this is our land. And of course, we clear it. So the boy, I got him to clear both sides, as you can see all along here. Both sides all clear. Done a fucking good job, I'll give him that. I'll give him that. Done a bloody good job. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Look at that nice walkway all the way down the bottom. It's cleared all the sides. Everything's been cleared up. Uh, 
So what I do is I come through, this, I cut this shit off down here, cut it off so I can get through. Because I can't get through with the bloody mower. So I keep saying to chick, trim it so I can go through with the mower, dolls. You know? So she planted all these trees. This is all goat food, all these ones. All goat food. So she gets some bananas when she gets up in the morning. It's 6.30. Gives them bananas. And then after breakfast, they have hammered corn and bran. And all their bowls. And then she goes out at um, 9 o'clock. And she gets all the branches from out the front and out all these ones here. Oh, look, they've done well. Yep, he's done bloody well. Look at that. That's good. Very pleased. So that's our land, like I said, from that marker there. The creek cuts in this side and goes down there. Before, the creek actually used to come across here. The creek used to actually come across here, hit that bank there, turn to the right and go down. So when we put all, we put 50 odd truckloads of 11 metres each into here and we lifted it up two feet and reclaimed it all back because it's all swamp. So we reclaimed it all, which was just how deep, this how deep it was. Reclaimed the whole lot, flattened it out and then we dug this out with the backhoe for the drainage. But we got all this land back that we can reuse. So it turned out bloody good guys. Turned out bloody good. Look at that fucking shit up there, would you? Oh god, fuck my door. Lots of thunder. It's gonna rain tonight. Pizza night, I hope the power doesn't go off. Not on pizza night, please. Not on pizza night. Right, I'm gonna say bye bye, guys. I'm gonna feed up all the animals now. It's feeding time. I said, the house has come up really nice. Oh shit, we'll have some tape on the windows here. So tomorrow we're going to start on the laundry. We're going to pull everything out of the laundry. We're going to take all the tin off the roof and grind, brush every, all the um, steel, steel that's there. Get rid of that flaky fucking super reflective heat stuff that, that falls apart. Look at this. It's fucking beautiful, do not it? Absolutely beautiful. So pull everything off of the roof. Then we'll clean it down, paint it, and put the roof back up on top. And uh, we'll be right. We've got ceiling for all the gutters to do along there as well. Hello, I. Mm. How are you? Yeah. So all this will come off. This shit just falls apart. It's not like the stuff we had in Thailand. Thailand was really, really strong. This stuff is absolute shit. So we're going to pull all that off, and I'm going to put the decking the same as what we got here. This stuff that we have inside, that is going to go all through here. Totally seal that in and all along here. I don't know how they missed out on that when they built the place. I don't know, but that's the last. So we're going to be doing that tomorrow, guys. So stay tuned. All right, guys, we're going to catch us all later on. Thanks for watching. I'm on Aussie Farm in the Philippines. It's been a great day. Hung over to start with, but feeling good now. See you later, guys.